This is the Business of Leadership Series Minute with your host, the best-selling author of Don't Buy a Duck and founder of MarketingStrategyHero.com, Derek Champagne. Our guest today is Shannon Adkins. She's a thought leader and CEO of Future State. Shannon, thanks for being with us today. Thanks for having me. I'm excited to talk to you and your listeners. We understand your mindset, your pivot, uh, asking what the world needs more of, have a purpose-led company. Mm -hmm. Tell me about the importance of investing in the community, of being a part of the community, and how that fits into your overall ecosystem. Yeah, so we we are in downtown Oakland. Um, Oakland, California is a city in a massive amount of transition. So uh, gentrification is hitting hard here. We have a lot of folks of color that are being pushed out of the city. Um, housing is insane. It's it's uh, I guess people who are more familiar with East Coast cities, you know, it's the Brooklyn of of the New York City ten years ago, right? And we are seeing that here in Oakland. So housing prices have shot up. A lot of displacement, a lot of homelessness, a lot of angst and and anxiety about all of the things that keep that make Oakland so extraordinary, the diversity, the art, the culture, the food scene, the redwood forests, you know, all the things that make Oakland extraordinary are at risk. And nobody really wants to see Oakland become San Francisco East. They want it to stay Oakland. Hmm. Um, So we have, we do work with our community partners um, on issues of homelessness, um, housing, issues of equity and inclusion, issues of race. Um, We actually house a nonprofit rent-free in our physical space that's working on uh, all of those issues and social justice issues. Um, And we've been doing that for two years now. Uh, We make our space available to social ventures and to nonprofits for their their personal events. We fundraise and do community activities ourselves. So we, we do an annual fundraiser to raise money for the Alzheimer's Association. We do lakeside cleanups. We've worked as volunteer teams and Project Homeless Connect and Habitat for Humanity. And then we encourage our team members, you know, we give them certainly volunteer hours paid. But on top of that, we really encourage them to look at what, what boards can you join? How can you become more active in your community? We have a team member who successfully ran for for office while employed by Future State um, and help holds that office. Uh, we have team members that are on the board of their local, um, you know, school board or on their local nonprofit of cho- of their choosing. Um, and and so we really encourage people to find opportunities for leadership and contribution inside of their work time, you know, within reason, right. uh, and and to take care of those community obligations and to connect us to those community obligations. I personally think that the solving of a number of our challenges inside of communities that are that are facing the challenges that Oakland's facing, which is a lot of communities is a collaboration between the business ecosystem, the nonprofit ecosystem and the government sector. So figuring out how to be effective conveners and connectors, um, as well as potentially offering some of our services to those uh, less resourced entities, like just like we do for Wells Fargo and for Genentech and for Roche, let's provide that service and structure to the city of Oakland as they grapple with the issues that are that are challenging them. Um, and, and so I think for us, it's that really looking at what does that private public partnership look like? How do we work on these initiatives and bring our skills to bear? And how do we show up in the community as a partner, not as, um, you know, hey, we're here, the rent's a little less, we just really want access to the talent. We don't really care about our town. You know, it was really intentional and deliberate that we moved our offices to Oakland. That was a designed choice for us. Derek Champagne here. I want to connect with you if you're listening to the Business Leadership Series. We can connect on LinkedIn or send me a message at Derek at DerekChampagne.com. I look forward to connecting.